Alright guys, I'm gonna leave the uh, the commentary to Brian Adams, Rod Stewart, and Sting today. This is all for you guys. There when you're to heaven to hold in this love inside. I swear I'll always be strong. And there's a reason why I prove to you we belong. I'll be the one that protects you. From the wind and the rain. Let's make it all for one and all for love. But the one you hold is the one you want, the one you need. Cause when it's all for one, it's one for all. When there's someone that you know, then just let your feelings show. Loves the song, ladies and gentlemen. It's and also guest appearance by Tyler. <clears throat> hmm. Who refuses to talk? Indecisive word. <laughs> that cat is a whore. No more of a whore than you are. Yep. Watch out for them raptors. Alright, so this oh, cat she's... was trying to climb up my dresser, like... To scale up. You know, I don't have any patience for this thing. Grenade gun? Damn it, I ran out of grenades and I killed the raptor in the first place. Yeah, because you shot it twice. <laughs> That's what I like to call the <laughs> pissed off raptor who really isn't dead but totally screwed you over. That was terrible. Don't hate yourself. Oh, and then there's the cat through the window again. She loves the window. She's like dame dogs. Those punk ass. I hate them dame dogs. So how is painful in these doctor's appointment thing? Oh, brutal. <clears throat> it was brutal, like Aaron said. It was so brutal that I couldn't even contain myself. I walked in there and I punched the receptionist and I was broke. <laughs> what doctor did you go to in Aaron? <laughs> the OBGYN. The OB one with doctors as offices? Yeah. Yeah, it was pretty epic. She's like, oh, I take it you're Tyler? Because I was like, excuse me, is there a Lindsay Costello here? She's like, yeah, and I was like, oh, yeah, really? <laughs> Punched her right through the glass and everything. I went mad with power. I couldn't stop myself. Why are you guys watching that? Why not? <laughs> Why aren't you watching it is the question. Yeah, dude. Dude. Well, because it's two guys. Two. Three. Well, it was two guys before me and a cat walked in. This is like a really bad sitcom. <laughs> and I come into you guys singing that song. And yeah, it looked a little gay on your guys' part. Nah, don't worry about it. <laughs> it's the tiny bit. You've never seen this. You gotta see it. Anyway. You should probably be commentating. Yeah, you should be commentating. <clears throat> um, I'm trying to pay attention to everybody. Anywho. Oh, hey, Ken. Hey, pay attention to me. Pay attention to me. Pay attention to me. I'm needing... Oh, my God. 7248. I got that. 7248. Oh, God. Wait, Tyler, 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 you're, you're gonna miss it. <laughs> Aside from Rod Stewart, 
Sting and <laughs> Brian Adams. <laughs> Brian Adams doing the first part of the commentary. I just released a, a lock for the room I'm hopefully going to be able to get access to now. So that we can continue on on this uh, festive sort of journey that we're doing here. Oh, it was me! And I'm currently watching my um, last video. Or part, yeah, part eight. Which everyone appears to like. Scratch and sniff! God, where have you been? <clears throat> There's only been five minutes when I get Holy balls! Gas experiment. Oh my god, this is not the room. This is not the room. No, no, no. No, but Prepare there's a. For the, the, the stuff with the guy and the thing in the bowels. Oh, what? Alright. Some gas stuff. I'm gonna have to equalize the level out. Ooh, this is gonna be fun. Um. Uh-oh. <laughs> Green. Blue. Shit. Oh, that was just gonna go all the way back to the top. <laughs> the balls. Oh. I saved him. <clears throat> sort of. <laughs> oh my god, excuse me. <clears throat> excuse me again. Communist pig. Are you okay? <coughs> he needs some cough straps, I'm sorry. Three cola! <laughs> Kirk! This is more boring <coughs> uh, stuff. It's not important. Hmm. I was thinking about that. Yes, I got one of the things so I can get behind that terminal. You know what? Today I was at school. And... You know, I was worried because my... my it's a trap! Not yet. I guess not. It is a trap! <clears throat> Nigga, I'm fucked. Now I get to poison this thing half to death. I'm so excited. Ha ha! I'm gonna enjoy watching him die. Time to play it. Let's press some buttons. Ha 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 ha! You want to poison raptors? I want to poison raptors. Ooh, hey, ooh, is this proper the... Crap of the rapper, the after years, and he killed raptors for a living. Bitch, so learned his lesson. Snip, 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 snip! Yeah, whatever, I did that on my own. It's like Luke blowing up the Death Star. I just closed my eyes and pressed buttons. He did, he closed buttons. <laughs> or, he yeah. closed buttons. He closed buttons and pressed eyes. <laughs> Ow, look what I'm doing! Sorry, I just wanted to suck dick. I'm sorry, guys. I'm stuffing my fat face with pop tarts. You know, why do you go in the kitchen again when there's some right here? Still. Are you kidding me? Anyway, as I was saying before the raptor got poisoned, my girlfriend broke down in school today because she take her she took creative writing. And well, in this creative writing class, she had to write a poem, and she wrote one about her brother. Okay. And I don't know anything about this poem, but. I find it funny because she complains about how she hates her brother. And then she wrote a poem about him and cried about it. I'm sorry. I'm not. Oh, okay. <laughs> oh, shit! <laughs> I've got ten months to eat these Skittles and I don't think I can do it! You scared the shit out of me. I thought something important was going on. You scared the shit out of me. Now you go in the dark. Hey, I can go back in that one room and do stuff. No, you can't. No, I can't. There's no room for you to go into and do stuff. Oh, okay. Living in my asshole. Oh my god, sorry, sorry. Pooping in your face, man. Eating the wonderful Alright, so at this... This is one of those dry points in the game. Like some Capcom... 
I want to say all survival horror games, there's a point where you just have to run around and do stuff. Like, um, Resident Evil's notorious for that. Where you don't really get to do a whole lot, except for just run around and activate traps and, you know, just get the game moving along. It's just the basic core plot movement. Um, we're, we're fine down here now, um, how are you? I guess not. It was on the thing he gave you, wasn't it? Oh, huh, that could be it. Three six one nine five. Three six nine five. Three six. Ha ha ha. We'll just make sure of that again. Three six. Yeah, it looked like a one for me. Oh. So I apologize if it's is if it, if this isn't all exciting or not or anything. Oh, I love this part. Just... I don't remember how to do this. Oh, here's a deal. Oh. Okay, so... I did it wrong. <laughs> so I might do, sit here for 10 minutes doing this. There we go. And then need an empty space there. Wrong! I must stop Christmas from coming. This is gonna get irritating. There we go. So close and so far away. If only I could switch this uh, thing. There you go. <laughs> That's a cool sound effect. Yes. Yes. Cool. We're right back. Alright. I don't remember where that light was, so I'm going to assume it's in the blue section. found the clue. This is the key card that will lead you to enter the secure <laughs> secret lab. The only chance to enter it is during tonight's experiment. Obtain the other key card without hesitation. The other key card is in the chief's room. I heard the secret codes for the hidden safer <laughs> on the panel keys. Now if we find out where the laboratory is, everything will be solved. I'll leave that to you. Good luck. Mike. Poor Mike. Probably got his ass killed. I don't know. So, let's... Hit back the old jism trail, as uh, John Wayne would like to say if you were a homosexual. <clears throat> Hopefully, John Wayne wasn't a homosexual. Well, we're uh, coming up on um, the uh, almost 15 minute mark here, so I'm going to cut it off here. Um, I hope you've enjoyed, and I apologize for any um, dry slowness that's going on. So, until next time, I'm Novakistan. I'm Trenta, and there's also Brian Adams, Sting, and Rod Stewart. <laughs> Take Bye. it easy, guys.